to the land. Oh! 
Where's my sister? Yonder she lies. Where? There, under the house. It's my fault. I'm so sorry my house dropped on her. You dropped a house on my sister? <laughs> How could anyone be so unbelievably clumsy? Look closer. Ah! You recognize her then? Of course I recognize her. Who else would wear the ruby slippers with those socks? The ruby slippers! Little girl, you have done me a service. I shall don the ruby slippers, which will make my power greater than ever. The ruby slippers! They're good! The slippers! What the ah! Did you take them? Where did you put them? See for yourself. Step forward, Dorothy. Give them back to me or off! You see what he's doing? There they are and there they'll stay. <laughs> Give me back those slippers. I'm the only one who knows how to use them. They're of no use to you. Give them back to me. Give them back! Keep tight inside of them, Dorothy. Their magic must be very powerful or she wouldn't want them so badly. You stay out of this, Linda, or I'll fix you as well. Oh, fiddle-faddle. You have no power while we're here. Be gone before someone drops a house on you, too. Very well, eventually I'll have those slippers, <laughs> and my revenge too. Just try to stay out of the way. I'll get you, my pretty, and you look dog too. <laughs> I'm afraid you can't do that. The sooner you get out of Oz altogether, the safer you'll sleep, my dear. Oh, I'd give anything to get out of Oz altogether, but which is the way back to Kansas? I can't go the way I came. No, that's very true. The only person who might know would be the great and wonderful Wizard of Oz himself. <laughs> the Wizard of Oz? Is he good or is he wicked? Oh, very good, but very mysterious. He lives in the Emerald City, and that's a long journey from here. Did you bring your broomstick with you? <laughs> no, I'm afraid I didn't. Well then, you'll have to walk. The Munchkins will see you to the border of Munchkin then. And remember, never let those ruby slippers off your feet for a moment. Or you'll be at the mercy of the Wicked Witch of the West. But which is the way to the Emerald City? And will anyone go with me? We cannot go ourselves, Siri, but I will give you my kiss. And no one will dare injure you. It's always best to start from the beginning. And all you have to do is just follow the yellow brick road. But what happens if I just follow the yellow brick road? Why? People come and go so quickly here. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. <laughs> Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Bye, Dan. Scare crows. Who can't be scared? So why don't you leave? 
I can't. I have this pole holding me up. If you could take it away, I'd be very grateful. Well, I guess I can lift you up here and then... Oh! Oh! Hey! Oh, I'm great. It doesn't hurt. Oh! When I fall, look! I can walk! Watch me! Oh, whoops! There goes some more of me again. Oh, yeah. scare you? No, no, of course not. I just thought you hurt yourself. But I didn't scare you? No. <sighs> I didn't think so. Can I walk with you always? If you'd like. I'm going to see Oz in the Emerald City so he can send me back home to Kansas. My house just landed here and I'm not sure why or how. What's the Emerald City? Who's Oz? Don't you know? I don't know anything. I'm stuffed so I have no brains. <laughs> Maybe that's why my conversations with crows are always so boring. <laughs> Oz is a very great wizard, and he lives in a far off city. I'm going, maybe you can ask him for some brains. I hear he's very powerful. Do you think he gives them to me? I don't know, but you won't be any worse off than you are now. This is true. Well then, I'll come with you. Are you all right? I'm all right, just a little wobbly. Nothing to worry about. Bye crows, do my best to the farmers. Won't be bothering any of you anymore. Goodbye, Here we go. Goodbye, Scarecrow. I'm gonna miss that old hay bag. Wait. I second that. Oh, you're right. <laughs> right you are. I'm gonna love having the brains.